there's also something called the binding energy. Right now, you are bound to the surface of the planet. If you watch carefully, I'm bound to the planet, right? I can't get off the planet because I don't have enough energy. But if I had enough energy, I could leave the planet. And it turns out that that binding energy is just equal to, okay, the binding energy is equal to the work that we would need to do, which would be equal to, this is the work done by the force applied, if we were applied a force to me, the change in gravitational potential energy. So the work would be equal to the change in gravitational potential energy, which would be equal to the gravitational potential energy final minus the gravitational potential energy initial. So this work we're finding here is the work needed to remove an object from the planet. Well, what would be the gravitational potential energy of an object if we completely remove it from the planet? Zero, because it would be infinitely far away. So the gravitational potential energy final would be equal to zero. Minus whatever we start with initially, which is going to be big G mass of the object, the mass of the Earth, divided by the radius of the Earth. So the work done by the force applied, or the binding energy, is going to be big G, the mass of the object, the mass of the Earth, divided by the radius of the Earth. Now I'm a bit confused, because over here, we have the change in gravitational potential energy was equal to the negative of the work. And here, we have the work is equal to the positive of the change in gravitational potential energy. Please explain. Travis. Well, um, the left side of the board, it's the work due to force of gravity, here is the force of gravity. Notice, it's the work done by which force? This was the work done by the force of gravity, which is equal to the negative change in gravitational potential energy. But here, we're talking about the work done by the force applied. That is, the force applied to the object in order to remove it from the planet. So notice, there are two different things. And the work done by the force applied is going to be equal to the positive change in gravitational potential energy, whereas the work done by the force of gravity is going to be equal to the negative of the change in gravitational potential energy. 